Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh The Honorable Audience It's my pleasure to be here and to present to you my view on Sustainable Development Goals especially point number 6 Maybe everyone is familiar with the word water and sanitation Yes, word with big influence on the life of living being Water sanitation is defined as the process of cleaning and purifying water so that is safe for use Clean water and proper sanitation program are also included in 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development Goals or SDGs. The fact today, in our country, in Indonesia, there are still many people who don't have adequate access to clean water and sanitation. Data from Central Statistic Agency or PPS show that around 27.7 million people in Indonesia are still experiencing clean water and sanitation crisis. World Health Organization data show the lack of access to clean water and sanitation can harm public health, especially children. Poor sanitation and unsafe drinking water are the reason why many children die from diarrhea in almost all country. In Indonesia, especially in 2020, Around 40% of death of children under 5 year are caused by diseases related to water and sanitation. In addition, Indonesia also suffered an annual economic loss, 56.7 trillion in medical and accommodation costs as a result of poor sanitation. Several countries have provided good sanitation and clean water programs, such as Germany, France and Norway. When the program, the our groundwater protection program with our Norway Norwegia program managed to track the Midgar snake from water management, the tunnel with of capacity of fifty thousand cubic meter is used as the store resolver and trans transformation role. The has Indonesia government done something too, of course. Yes, Indonesia government has launched programs such as the Community Based Water and Sanitation Program or PAMSIMAS and the Community Based Total Sanitation Program or STBM. However, the implementation of this program still faces various obstacles such as regulatory issues and also lack of fund. Government should not stand alone to solve this out problem. There are Therefore, synergy from the government, society, and the private sector is needed to solve this problem. Several things can be done by all of the parties to improve the problem of clean water and proper sanitation. Including is the first one, we can early education regarding the importance of clean water and proper sanitation for life by providing Education on the benefit of clean water and good sanitation to prevent various diseases caused by poor sanitation. The second one, we can checking water quality and creating a planning system for healthy and clean, clean drinking water by providing water filtering at home. The third one, we can do increasing irrigation channel and water absorption as well as rehabilitation and conservation of water to reduce unsafe plan in order to improve to, to improve good drainage quality. And the last one, we can create innovation in the field of clean water, sanitation, and hygiene in the form of ready-to-use water management and storage of water several feet for consumption. By this implementation, I hope we can make our dream come true. That's all about clean water and sanitation Indonesia for our better life. That's all about my speech. Thank you very much for attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.